hello to the University of Pennsylvania's class of 2013. Thank you, thank you, hey that's a great mortar board message, Biden 2016. Thank you all. Much love to the Ivy League. It's an honor to be standing here in a historic Franklin Field, where a drunk Howard Cosell puked all over dandy dumb Meredith's cowboy boots on Monday Night Football in 1970. Okay, I borrowed that from Michael Bloomberg's pen commencement speech of 08. First Bono from U2, then Jody Foster, then Bloomberg, now me. From Bono to Biden, that's so awesome. Big shout out to my man Denzel Washington, whose son Malcolm is among the graduating seniors. And special thanks to Penn for my honorary doctorate. Easier than actually earning one. Class of 2013, never forget the future is in your control. You are the most competent, caring generation this nation has produced. Your generation has provided momentum for both. A path to citizenship for 11 million undocumented immigrants. And marriage equality. We don't condemn our LGBT community in America. If two dudes or two chips want to marry I say let them. America leads the world in innovation because it's people challenge orthodoxy. That doesn't happen in a hellhole like China. Our advances in science and technology allow people with prosthetic legs to climb mountains. Every graduating class faces unique challenges. My generation witnessed Dr. Martin Luther King's assassination and the war in Vietnam. What about you guys? Terrorism and climate change? Please. I had to get five draft deferments. I've gained too much wisdom to offer any advice. Thank you all very much. Now, President Gutman. No Amy, I'm finished. That's all I have. Folks, say hello to your next speaker, Xerox CEO, Ursula M. Burns, the first black, I mean African-American, woman to run a Fortune 500 company.